Hello, and thank you for joining us for our Entrepreneur Spotlight. I'm here with Jorge Garcia Suazaga, the president and founder of Apex Dermatology. Thank you for joining us. Thank you very much for having me. Well, we're here to talk about your entrepreneur journey. Can you share with us how did you start your business and what inspired you to start it? So I started Apex Dermatology in 2011, mm -hmm. really with one idea, which was really to change the the patient access problem that we have in Northeast Ohio to, to access to a dermatologist. Mm -hmm. Oftentimes when you're calling for an appointment for a dermatology or skin cancer check, you're waiting you know, for six months to get in. Yes, so I started saying, hey, you know, maybe there's a better way of doing things. And I started Apex really with a focus on patient experience, um, you know, same day, next day appointments. And that's kind of how the idea started. Wow. Um, what are some valuable lessons that you started or, you know, that you've learned as an entrepreneur? You know, when I first started the group, um, it was very challenging because, you know, we were, we were, you know, just three or four of people, you know, there was me and there was, a, you know, two or three of the, yeah. the, the, my staff that would help me. And uh, so it was challenging to kind of get all the systems in place, you know, mm -hmm. you know, we were starting to, to get the word out, you know, how do you get the, the patients to, to know who you are? So it was, it was challenging to start. But, you know, I, I always think if you have a passion to what you do and you're, and you're good at it, then uh, patients will slowly start coming in and they start trusting you. At the end, healthcare is all about trust. And, uh, you know, I, I think we're doing a good job on that, yeah. on that front. So, uh, so you started with three or four staff. Where are you at now? Mm -hmm. So at the beginning, we had four staff, you know, and now we're 12 locations, 170 plus staff. Um, so we have, you know, it's a, it's a whole different organization now than, than it was when we started. Yeah, it's wow. really cool. So how long did that growth take? You, you know, the idea was never to grow that mm -hmm. quick. You know, mm -hmm. I realized that, you know, in, in the healthcare, you kind of have to kind of serve a, a wider net, serve a wide population. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we've been growing at a pace of an office a year or so in a different location. Our, and it, but that wasn't really the plan. It just kind of happened. Mm -hmm. um, you know, my, my attitude has always been, hey, let's go to places where there's need um, so that we can serve that population. And, and skin cancer is all over the place, and a lot of people, unfortunately, are walking around without knowing it. So, you know, we, we do a lot of skin cancer screenings and mm -hmm. really focus on, on, on collaborating with the community, and that's how we get the word out. Yeah. So what advice would you give an entrepreneur that wanted to start their business? If you want to start your own business, my advice would be to, you know, have a vision, put, put it on paper, um, try to you know, maybe talk to a, a colleague or a mentor so that, you know, they can critique it a little bit and challenge the idea. Uh, but don't be afraid to kind of take in that, that step, which is, hey, I'm going to try, I'm going to go, I'm going to, I'm going to, you know, bet on you, you know, bet on myself and, and move forward with the idea. And, and, you know, you have to kind of plan it, but, you know, be resilient and you'll be, you'll be fine. That's really great advice. <laughs> so tell us, what does the future hold for Apex? You know, at Apex, we're always looking at, you know, consistently focusing the patient experience. I, I tell people, I want people to kind of, they come to Apex as, um, you know, we're the rock stars of dermatology, I'll tell our group, right? Because think about the last time you went to see a concert. You went there and you got all energized and you're like, wow, these guys are good. So the next day you, you tell your, your, your friends, hey, I, was, I went to see this person. Mm -hmm. Well, I always share with my staff that that's what they do. That's, that's the, they're they're uh, performers for a living. So, mm -hmm. you know, what we do is when, when that patient shows up in our, at Apex front desk, you know, that's, that's our stage, you know. Mm -hmm. So we, we, we want to make sure that we make that experience really special so that when the patient comes out, say, hey, these guys got me on time. They diagnosed me. They cure my cancer. I feel great. I'm going to tell my friends. Oh, I love so that. So that's kind of like the, the, the energy that we want to get at Apex. Um, and we really value the culture of the group. Mm -hmm. So I think that um, having a meaningful work uh, purpose is important to kind of, so you can feel part of something bigger rather than just punching in and punching out, just doing your thing. Just, you feel a part of a bigger thing, a bigger mission. I think it's, it's, uh, it's kind of where, where, that's how, that's part of our DNA. That's how our big differentiator culture. Wow. When should a person go to Apex? 
if you have a new lesion of concern, if you have a new dermatologic, you know, you have acne or mm -hmm. psoriasis or something that's not getting better, mm -hmm. um, call us, you know, or, or check out our website, apexskin.com. Mm -hmm. You know, we have usually same day or next day appointments. Mm -hmm. Oftentimes, um, the patients that have a dermatology question go to see their primary care doctor because, because they can't get into a dermatologist. Mm -hmm. But at Apex, we'll get you in the, right away in a, uh, and then we can evaluate you. Most of these visits are covered by insurance. Mm -hmm. um, so mm -hmm. it's pretty easy on you and, and uh, we make it really easy and seamless to, to, to come check us out. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Now, if you have found this video insightful and you have advice, be sure to comment. And thank you for watching.